So question nine is that a student investigates the breakdown of fats in milk by lipase. Four test tubes labeled A, B, C, and D are set up. The table shows the contents of each test tube. And in which test tube will the contents become acidic most quickly? Okay, so let's talk about the breakdown of fats again. Let's let's hone in on the key thing that they're testing on here. So when you're breaking down fats, what are two things that I require? I need two things. I need two of them. I need number one. I need an enzyme, which is lipase, right? Lipase breaks down lipids, which is basically fats. So that's my enzyme. But that is not enough, guys. I also need bile because the bile will help to emulsify the whole thing. So therefore, making the digestion of the lipids easier. So I need lipase and I need bile. So I need both things. So therefore, in my test tube, for anything to happen, I definitely need the bile. Right, so I need anything. So that therefore, this eliminates C because C doesn't even have bile. Forget about it. You cannot suggest successfully digest fats and lipids without bile. I also need lipase. Right, so I definitely need lipase. So that eliminates which one? That eliminates B because B doesn't have lipase. So now I've I've, I've narrowed it down to A and D. Now. The question says it's investigating the breakdown of fats in milk. So of course I need milk, right? So D doesn't even have milk. D doesn't have milk, so I'm going to eliminate that. And therefore, this is A. And if you're wondering why there's a test tube here, it's because I'm trying to show what's happening. Okay, so you've have the you have the milk in there. You have the milk in there, and then you're going to add the lipase and the bile, right? They both go into there, and therefore they will start to break down. The things and therefore become acidic. Ah, we didn't talk about that, guys. This is good for revision. Why would it become acidic? Why? Because when you break down lipids, what do they become? What are the building blocks of lipids? Lipids are made up of. Remember, like this. Does this mean anything to anyone? <laughs> right. What does this mean? It means is made up of this pink unit here, which is what? What is it? It's the glycerol. Glycerol. And what are those three legs there? What are they? Those three leggies. Those are the, the, the fatty acid tails, right? The fatty acid tails. These are the fatty acid tails. Fatty acid. So three fatty acid tails, right? And that's why it becomes acidic because you've now broken down so that you release those fatty acids. That's why it's acidic. So before you break it down, is this whole thing here? That's not acidic. But after you break, 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 right? You break it with the lipase. It will then become acidic because the fatty acid tails are now released.